know, there's lots of solidarity in the community, and it just, the ideals of Contra really align with my, my belief. dance once a week. Here, University of Chicago dances once a month. Fermi Lab dances twice a month. There's a queer contra. Sometimes we techno contra. Uh, there's all kinds of contra, which is why it's so great. All right, two couples. Uh, in a contra dance, the two whole hall would be lines of like 20 people or three lines, whereas squares are the topography of four or six people in micro patterns. What's great about Contra is that it's super simple in that it's based on walking. So there's no complex rhythmic patterns that you have to know with your feet and people will just pull you through it. It's such a, um, such a great community building experience. It's all the really weird people that, that contra dance, you, you know, usually the people who are kind of socially awkward or even even not, um, there's lots of, you know, people who don't do other types of dances. I think it's a really close-knit, loving community that's very forgiving and very accepting of people of all kinds. Uh, so it's intergenerational. I dance with people half my age. Uh, people don't care about gender, so people dance with same-sex people. People don't care uh, about anything. The best way I've heard it described is the illegitimate stepchild of English country dance, which, um, if you're familiar with English country dance, it's what you would see in Jane Austen movies like Pride and Prejudice. Um, when it came over to America, it became a little bit more rowdy, a little bit more rural. Um, but it has in its roots the um, wonderful dances from France and England uh, that got preserved in the rural areas and still exist there today. It's a great uh, spiritual, physical, and emotional conglomeration. I feel like I exercise all of those things. As a person who's getting older, I really want to stay physically alive, I want to stay spiritually alive, and I want to stay emotionally alive. I think that at the end of the day, it really isn't about Contra. Contra is important, but instead of Contra holding us together, I think as a community, we hold Contra together. I think people tend to be well-educated, liberal, um, environmentally interested hippies. <laughs> um, at first they're like, I just want to watch. Um, but like, that's just not a thing. You gotta, gotta participate and everyone will just 